so today we will uh, see in case of class 10 that is the uh, oxidizing properties of the sulfuric acid here we will see define reaction of uh, sulfuric acid uh, as it shows the oxidizing uh, nature define reactions also uh, how we actually we have to define metals and uh, non metals uh, to give that particular um, characteristics of uh, oxidizing nature so let's start with the oxidizing property of sulfuric acid so today we will start with the oxidizing properties of uh, concentrated sulfuric acid so concentrated sulfuric acid is a very strong oxidizing agent which exhibits its oxidizing power when it reacts with non metals metals and different inorganic compounds on thermal decomposition if we see uh, that uh, concentrated sulfuric acid produces nascent oxygen which is responsible for its uh, strong oxidizing power concentration sulfuric concentrated sulfuric acid undergoes decomposition reaction to form nascent oxygen that is h2so4 change into uh, h2o plus so2 plus nascent oxygen now if we see the uh, action of concentrated sulfuric acid on carbon then uh, uh, actually carbon react with concentrated sulfuric acid to form carbon dioxide sulfur dioxide and h2o that is c plus 2 h2so4 change into co2 plus 2so2 plus 2h2o when sulfur react with concentrated sulfuric acid to form sulfur dioxide gas concentrated h2so4 is itself reduced to so2 that is s plus 2h2so4 change into 3so2 plus 2h2o if phosphorus react with concentrated sulfuric acid then also phosphoric acid is formed by oxidation of uh, phosphorus and concentrated sulfuric acid itself is reduced to sulfur dioxide that is 2p plus 5h2so4 change into 3 uh, 2h3po4 plus uh, 5so2 plus 2h2o now what happens when uh, different metals are treated with concentrated sulfuric acid if we see that except novel metal like um, uh, gold and platinum all other metals are oxidized by concentrated sulfuric acid to form the corresponding metal sulfates and concentrated h2so4 itself get reduced to sulfur dioxide gas there is mg plus 2h2so4 change into mgso4 plus so2 plus 2h2o zn plus 2h2so4 change into zso4 plus so2 plus 2h2o or uh, fp plus 2h2so4 change into feso4 plus so2 plus 2h2o now if uh, concentrated sulfuric acid on uh, inorganic compound if we see the reaction that is uh, uh, hydrogen iodide that is concentrated h2so4 oxidizes hydrogen iodide to liberate iodine vapor and itself reduce to form sulfur dioxide gas that is 2 hi plus h2so4 change into i2 plus so2 plus 2h2o if concentrated h2so4 oxidizes hydrogen sulfide that is h2s to uh, sulfur and itself is reduced to produce uh, sulfur dioxide and gas that is h2s plus h2so4 then change into s uh, plus so2 plus uh, 2h2o so uh, actually here uh, main thing is that uh, that second ionization energy of any group 2 element is lower than the second ionization energy of the corresponding group 1 element Phosphoric acid is a um, uh, syrupy liquid and uh, shows oxidizing power with uh, acidic properties. That is actually uh, thing is that when uh, this uh, phosphoric acid is formed, then actually is also act as a uh, this uh, acidic properties. So today up to that, uh, next day we will start with another topic.